I give the floor to the representative of Association Mauna for Human Rights and Immigration. Thank you, Vice President. We start by thanking the Special Rapporteur for his report and asserting that the right to development is tethered to freedom of expression and association. Yet, in the recent assessment of democratic pluralism in Cambodia, we find that both set components are compromised. Hence, we express deep concern about the human rights situation in the state. The 2020 State of Emergency Law has restrained the power to declare an emergency and curb civic liberties in the hands of a few. Hence, legally silencing critics of government policy. This diminishes the scope for peaceful assembly and freedom of expression, corroborated by the rising threats and harassment towards journalists and human rights defenders, and their subsequent arbitrary arrest and detention. All these factors contribute towards preventing the development of multi-party democracy in Cambodia. The COVID-19 pandemic has further normalized said restrictions under the pretext of the 2021 law on preventive measures against the spread of COVID-19 and other severe, dangerous, contagious diseases. This law not only overrides the mobility rights of citizens, but also impedes on their right to privacy. By allowing public disclosure of personal data of patients who contacted COVID. Therefore, Maona and Geneva International Center for Justice support the Special Rapporteur's recommendation to reform the above mentioned laws, 